All right, now, this is a, we call this three cone reaction drill. Again, we use different color cones. Let's just say red, white, blue. This cone over here will represent uh, drawing a charge. So what will happen if, because what we're going to do, we're going to start this guy, and this guy will be chopping in the middle, and we'll call out red. When we call out red, he's going to go over here, and this guy's going to attempt to drive, and he's going to take a charge. Boom, charge. Okay? Then he's going to get back up, start back chopping again, and we'll say white. And then this is a closeout situation. So he's going to give chop, choppy steps, baby steps, close out. This guy's going to act as if he's shooting. Go ahead. Just act as if you close it out. And then he'll go back. Come on back, back. And then because what we teach is we, we, we funnel guys' baseline. So this last one, this guy will try to go baseline, and we'll cut them off on the baseline. So if we call blue, try to go baseline, cut them off, and then come back to the middle. All right, so after you do each one, you know, we'll come back to the middle. We try to let guy get about 30 seconds, about two rounds of each thing. So we're going to go through that real quick. So you're going to chop your feet up, and we'll call them out, and we're gonna, not going to go in order. So, uh, blue. There you go. Red. Charge. Get up, get up, good job. White. Good. There we go. White. Good. Red. Good job. Get up. There we go. Blue. All right. So, and that's what we do. Now, you can do that at two different goals. You can have six guys on this end, six guys on that end. So, you, you know, time management. Uh, and, and that's the good part about that. And then we'll rotate this guy to there, rotate that guy to there, that guy there, and then, you know. But we'll have it going on two different goals, all right? So that's called three cone reaction. And again, we tell our offensive guys, you really, like on that charge, he's got to go in and give them something so he can have a realistic feel to it, all right? Um, the next drill we'll do, you can stay just where you are, you can move those cones off the floor. And you can step off my defensive guy. We'll need number one, one ball. We'll put the ball right here and stay in your area. And you can bag up a little bit. You can bag up a little bit. We call this one-on-one -on -one from the corner. And what we'll do, this young man right here will pass the ball. You, throw, you don't need your balls. He's going to throw his ball to this guy. You're going to sprint across. You're going to pass it to him. And you're going to play one-on-one -on -one from the corner. Just teaching guarding angles. That's from the base. That's from the... Uh, on the, in the baseline area, trying to guard the, the, from the corner, baseline, or what have you. This guy's going to drive, look to make a play, and you're going to try to stop him, okay? So it's one-on-one -on -one from the corner. Now, 